Hey guys, welcome back to Mind Link. Uh, please like, follow, and subscribe. We're definitely getting into something today. And you know what that is. That's going to be the second part of anger and how to take control of your anger and use it in a better light. As in, you use that energy that you're giving to anger to something sort of different emotion or different activity. Like, because a lot of times, uh, anger is not necessarily a bad thing. Anger is like a in per se it'd be a steroid in yourself so he's like you can use anger to strengthen something so say like when i go to the gym and i'm i'm tired now and i'm losing a lot of i'm very fatigued and it's i'm about to give up on the weights you can use anger to give you that second two that extra two to three reps so, like, especially if I get frustrated and I, like, instead of slamming the door, breaking glasses and stuff like that, I'll go work out. And it it actually eases that anger. It actually softens it out to make it not as sharp or as ferocious as it would have been if I just held it on in. So that's what we're going to go over today. Is we, you should definitely always try to find a different route. Instead of trying to use anger for hurting try to use anger for something else try to use it turn that anger into passion into something else give that you always have to give that energy to something else because if you just give it all to anger anger doesn't have a direct route on what's supposed to happen like how love is when you love somebody you want to hold and caress them and stuff like that but with anger it doesn't have that cherishing in it it all only has boom i'm angry and i want to hurt something I want to destroy something. But anger can, anger can also be used differently. So that's what I definitely challenge you guys to do. Is instead of using your anger to hurt. Try to use that anger in a different energy. Try to give that anger. that you The anger you got. The energy that's in that anger. Try to put it into something else. And I'm telling you it works. And I definitely recommend. Once again I, I, I always will tell you. Meditation is a good thing. If you want to learn to understand yourself, your inner self, meditation is the best way to go. So, once again, guys, I want to thank you for watching on my link. Please like, subscribe, follow, and hit that bell notification. All right, guys. Have a good day.